lady such as yourself isn't the problem. But what is? There has to be a scientific explanation. What could it be? Hi, Polly! Oh, hey, hi! Uh, yes, I see you. I said, hi, Polly! Oh, Polly needs help! What is it? Paxton's in trouble? No. Pierce guards on the well? Why? <laughs> Shoot! Oh, a fly! That is exciting! <gasps> Two wings, six legs, six thousand armatidia on two compound eyes. Does nothing gross you out? Not really. How is this getting rid of it, Shawnee? Huh. A small brown spot on the left wing. Eh, you don't have to be worried about getting rid of it. That is a Littleton fly. That means... A Littleton fly's lifespan is one day. One day? That fly will be gone by sundown. Now, I should get back to my garden. The flowers need something, but I don't know what. No, Shawnee. It chose to spend its whole wee little fly life with me. When I got this locket, I swore to use it to help those around me, make the world better, improve lives. Now, I can't improve everyone's lives, but I can make one fly's entire life tiny rific! Tiny power! Hi, um, Shawnee, what should we call him? I think she's a she. Uh, Sheila? Let's go, Sheila. I'm gonna make sure you have a tiny, rific life. I mean, it's just one day out of our many, many, many days, but for you, it's a whole lifetime. Polly, don't waste the little time she has dwelling on her mortality. Most tiny, rific life ever, starting now. <laughs> Citrus clarifying mask smells so good you could eat it. <laughs> but Sheila, we haven't gotten to the hot stone massage. Why would she leave? I would love to spend a day at the spa. Mm. Preliminary data suggests that flies don't like the same stuff as humans. Hmm. <laughs> away from that disgusting broccoli and algae protein shake that Lila left here last week! Don't you get it, Polly? Flies love gross stuff! Ah, <laughs> uh, really? Yep, the grosser the better. If you want to make Sheila's life tiny rific, just lead her to Paxson's diaper pail and I can get back to my garden and... <laughs> no diapers. I have a better idea. <laughs> My parents keep trash on the counter. It's not trash, it's compost. Fly! I heard a fly! Oh no! Dad! <laughs> Come with me if you want to live. I mean, live to your full lifespan, which is only gonna be. Polly! Flies. I hate flies. <laughs> Polly? Dad, uh, I'm upstairs and there's a fly up here. I'm coming, Polly, Polly! If it's gross you want, it's gross I will provide. What's beyond this door is not for the faint of heart. I give you Pierce's room. Still not grossed out? Nope. It's not so bad. Just a turkey sandwich. We haven't had turkey since Thanksgiving! Ooh, I've been wanting to do some experiments with mold. Maybe I'll be the next Alexander Fleming! 
And for those strange people among us who don't study mold in their spare time, that means... Come on, Polly. Even strange people know that Alexander Fleming discovered the antibacterial properties of some mold and... Jasmine's gonna be there? Well, this dude better get ready. <laughs> I wish I couldn't spell. Hmm. Oh. Oh. If you think her big brother's mess is good, just wait till you see what Polly's little brother can do. Shawnee, I told you, that's where I draw the line. Oh. No! <laughs> and girls love backwoodsman spray. I prefer the smell of the socks. <coughs> That's probably enough. Yeah, who am I kidding? You can never have enough backwoodsman spray. Well, that was something, eh, gals? What do you say we go grab a snack and spend the rest of Sheila's life? Him! I mean the rest of the day in my room. Fly. Come out, come out, wherever you are. Oh, you resisted the The old ravioli and the chunky cheese. But can you deny? The last slice of bread? That's not even really gross. <laughs> the last slice of bread where it's all brown and crusty? Ew! Get Sheila! I'll distract Dad! No! Hi, Dad! Polly, how did... where did... uh... Thanks for the call about the fly. Let me know if you see it buzzing around again. Yeah, sure thing! Okay, bye, Dad! I told myself I wouldn't cry. Shawnee, a song, please. <clears throat> Amazing fly, how sweet the buzz. <clears throat> Maybe something a little lighter? We don't want you-know-who to know you-know-what and is about to you-know-die. Okay, jaunty. I can do jaunty. <laughs> I'm Sheila the Fly, and I can't deny that Shawnee and Polly don't want to say bye. Whoa! Enough jitterbugging. I'll say a few words. Sheila, I am so glad I got to make your life tiny rific, even though it was a pretty gross day for me. It's. it's over. And now your watch has ended. When we met, I never thought I could come to care so much for a fly. But now, there will always be a compost can in my heart with your name on it. I guess you could say, we both had a big day. Sheila? You're alive? Where are you going? Um, you know how I said Sheila was a little tin fly because she had a brown spot on her wing? Well, turns out that spot was on my magnifying glass. Must have gotten it dirty in my garden this morning. So, Sheila's just a regular fly who lives a regular fly amount of time? Yep, like five days. Well, back to my garden. Huh? Wow, I did such a good job making Sheila's day great that she brought all her friends. All her... Oh dear. Oh! Every pocket for themselves! Polly, what should we do? It's time. Operation Dirty Diaper starts now. Come get it, flies! To the 
a little tin compost team. Least tiny horrific date ever. On the plus side, we have conclusive evidence. The Mod Quad can't operate with compost in its engine. Huh. My plants just need a nitrogen rich compost. Thanks, Polly. You really make every day of my life tiny horrific. What? Whose wife is horrific? I think I got compost in my 